thing that the admin didn't think to fortify these tunnels into town. You think Zara used this tunnel to get into Beacon Town too? Maybe. I still just can't believe she thinks she could take the admin on alone. I mean, we all knew she was a couple ingots short of a bucket. <laughs> I guess. Can't help but wonder if she would have been a bit more even keeled if she'd just gotten some darn rest. We've just got a really scary plan as it is. Knowing that at any minute Zara could come along is kind of stressing me out. Yeah, I know. I'm with you on that one. Right? I think it's really brave that she wants to try and face Romeo. Not everyone has that kind of courage. But is it courage to run into a fight that you're almost definitely not gonna win? That just seems dumb. <laughs> but there are a lot of people who would call what we're doing dumb. If she tries to confront Romeo before we can take his powers away, that'll be bad for everyone. Maybe it's for the best that Binta and the Fred Towners didn't make it out of the underneath. It would really stick to get above the bedrock just to have the admin, uh, you know. Yeah. Jesse, when Romeo finds out what we're trying to do, we've seen what he does. I don't want to end up like Fred. I don't want Beacon Town to be like Zara's town. We've seen so many terrible things that Romeo's done. I just can't even handle thinking about that happening to the others. To our home. Yes, things look impossible. And they might be. But I believe in all of us. Look how far we've come. Look at all the impossible we've already done. We can do this. I know it seems hopeless, but we can't give up now. There are people up there counting on us. And we are not going to let them down. Hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Let's do it. Yeah. Yeah, let's do the thing! Here we go. What do you guys want to bet that's where the primary terminal is? The giant floating tower with no clear entrance? Yeah, probably. We gotta find a way up there. Might be a good idea to hit the map shop. Regroup, get some supplies. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. Then he's with Axel and Olivia. We gotta hide. Oh, typical. Heading exactly where we wanted to go. Then I guess we just can't get caught. Why exactly are we having a whole festival devoted solely to you? Do we really have to go up on stage with you in front of everyone? Enough! You two are going to need to do a lot less talking and a lot more agreeing if you want to be a part of Beacon Town. Not so sure I do, actually. In fact, we were just about to head home. I'd be very careful if I were you guys, or there might not be a home to go back to at all. It's just so easy for something bad to happen to a town. Like Champion City, for example. Wait, what are you... Put that hand down, Romeo! Za- uh, I mean, do I know you? Zara, what is she doing? Don't play dumb with me, Romeo. Whatever Jesse here told you, it's all a lie! No, 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 I'm afraid that's where you stop talking.
Goodbye, old friend. I had hoped there was still a chance of redeeming Romeo. Now I'm not so sure. He just... Sara's... gone. Yeah. He's a monster. Through and through. And he needs to be put down. Yeah, I... I guess you're right. <sighs> I think I've proven my point. You will stay in Beacon Town, and you will continue to be my friends. Got it? You... you... Don't answer. I know you do. Now, we have a festival to prepare for. Speaking of, Stella! You're going to have my fireworks display ready, yes? Yes, admin... Uh... Jesse... Very good! I think the admin's distracted. Yeah. We should go grab Axel and Olivia while we have the chance. Oh, Zara. How I wish it didn't have to end that way. <sighs> Get over here, you iron simpleton. This was your fault, you hear? If you were any good at your job, you wouldn't have allowed someone like her in here. Psst. Olivia! Axel! Oh my gosh! I knew it! I just knew it! <gasps> Whoa, am I seeing double? Shh. Jesse, I... What is... Come on, I'll explain everything. But we have to get off the streets. To the map shop, quick. thing that the admin didn't think to fortify these tunnels into town. Oh. Speaking of fighting admins, I can't help but wish we still had Zara around. I know she was... well, she was a little much. But having an ex-admin on our side seems like it could have come in handy. Oof, I guess. She still scared me, though. She already helped us a lot. The portal? Buying us time to get up here? Yeah. Yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, maybe Zara's lucky being where she is right now. She's not currently marching towards a fight with the admin. I'm just glad that friends of Fred stayed at the entrance to that... that heckmouth. This is far too dangerous for them. Yeah. Jesse, when Romeo finds out what we're trying to do, we've seen what he does. I don't want to end up like Fred. I don't want Beacon Town to be like Zara's town. We've seen so many terrible things that Romeo's done. I just can't even handle thinking about that happening to the others. To our home. Hey, no one is going to end up like Fred. But how do you know? Fred didn't know just how bad Romeo was. So he underestimated him. We can learn from the people that came before us. I know it seems hopeless, but we can't give up now. There are people up there counting on us. And we are not going to let them down. Hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Let's do it. Woo! My, that was loud. Here we go. What do you guys want to bet that's where the primary terminal is? The giant floating tower with no clear entrance? Yeah, probably. We gotta find a way up there. Might be a good idea to hit the map shop. Regroup, get some supplies. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. Admin! And... He's with Axel and Olivia. We gotta hide. Oh, 
typical. Heading exactly where we wanted to go. Then I guess we just can't get caught. Why exactly are we having a whole festival devoted solely to you? Do we really have to go up on stage with you in front of everyone? Enough! You two are going to need to do a lot less talking and a lot more agreeing if you want to be a part of Beacon Town. Not so sure I do, actually. In fact, we were just about to head home. I'd be very careful if I were you guys, or there might not be a home to go back to at all. It's just so easy for something bad to happen to a town. Like Champion City, for example. And... Boop! My... no! I had hoped there was still a chance of redeeming Romeo. Now I'm not so sure. Champion City. He blew it up. Just to make a point. I know this looks really bad, but there's gotta still be some hope that we can get through to him. Somehow. You sound a lot more sure than I feel, Jesse. Now, how about you run along and get that fireworks show ready for the big keynote, eh? Yes, admin. Uh, Jesse. I think the admin's distracted. Yeah. We should go grab Axel and Olivia while we have the chance. What? You were always so worried about Champion City, and now... One less thing to worry about. My... my friends and... my people? They're... gone. Psst. Olivia! Axel! Oh my gosh! I knew it! I just knew it! <gasps> Whoa, am I seeing double? Shh. Jesse, I... What is... Come on, I'll explain everything. But we have to get off the streets. To the map shop, quick. <laughs> <laughs> 